we stand, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice. Welcome to HGTV. I'm your host, Nick Kinder. Hopefully you guys aren't as burned as me after spring break. And I'm Richard Butcher. You look forward to information regarding track results and prom. For birthdays today, happy birthday goes out to Connor Brousset, Tara Martinez, and faculty member Lisa Johnston. For lunch, on lines one and two will be Asian balls, three, soup and salad bar featuring chili soup, line four will be popcorn shrimp or pizza wedges, and line five will be closed. Sending it over to Mo with your daily dose of sports. Hello. My hands are hot, my body is not, my car is shot. I am distraught, the sleep's been fought. I got no snot. Let's get it brought before I rot. Let's get into sports. Trackwise, Nayeli Alanis ran a new season best time of 9.53 seconds in the 60 meter hurdles to finish 11th in the prelims, just three places short of making it into the finals. Evan Jordan was out on the opening height of six feet in the high jump, which is only two inches under his season best tomorrow. Well, you know, tomorrow. The girls' tennis team will travel to Carroll. Host, track is to host Clinton Prairie and Weibo, and softball is to host Crawfordsville. Anyway, that's it for sports. Hosts, do the hosty thing that you like the host or whatever you, ho, host. Rapper Nipsey Hussle was shot and killed outside his clothing store this Sunday. The Grammy-nominated rapper was taken to the hospital and pronounced dead. The killer is still unconfirmed. But who needs a gun for protection when you have strength in numbers? A group of spring breakers were held at gunpoint in an attempted robbery. Appears no one was harmed, except maybe the robber. Speaking of spring break, Nick, you're looking a little flaky. Yeah, I know. Uh, well, I guess you could say Arizona got the best of me over the week. <laughs> and other news, prom permission slips are available now. You'll need a ticket to be allowed to go to prom. Tickets this week will be sold for a reduced price of $20 a piece. After this week, the price will be raised to $25. Thanks for tuning in on the first day back from spring break. Make sure to tune tomorrow for even more stories and, and updates revolving around all spring break sports teams. Take care, everybody. That was...